Hey everyone, welcome to another unboxing. This time around, we have a Topps Garbage Pail Kids Chrome. This is the 1986 Series 4. Um, so yeah, what Topps has been doing, I think they've been doing it for actually quite a few years now, is chromifying their original sets. Um, basically what that means is they make you pay more because this is, eh, blaster boxes are usually 20. Um, but these are just shiny versions of the cards. Tops has been doing chrome version of cards for like decades. So I was on a trip to Colorado recently, saw these at Target. Couldn't pass them up because I needed stuff for my channel that weren't waifu cards. And so, um, and I love Garbage Bell Kids. So yeah, let's dive right into this bad boy. I do like getting blaster boxes. Now they are kind of pricey, but full boxes are usually in the over $100 price range. And usually blaster boxes you get a hit in, at least the WWF cards used to, but unfortunately Topps lost and or didn't renew the WWE license. And so I miss opening those types of boxes because there was always a fun surprise and I miss getting Carmella cards. So yeah, let's dive right in here. All right, here's pack number one. So yeah, I might have a few of these old school from back in the day. I used to buy these at 7-Eleven, not these Chrome, but these being the old original packs. Um, they were probably a quarter a pack or 50 cents or something crazy like that. But now, gosh, dollar plus. Let's see, what are the uh, parallels, of course. Um, refactors are probably more parallels. Yeah. Gosh. Printing plate. I've never opened up a printing plate of all the cars I've opened, except I bought a pack of limited run games booster box for, gosh, 200 plus, And I got a printing plate like you were guaranteed. So I had to spend $200 to get a printing plate. Now, yeah. Name variation short print. What is that? All right, let's dive right in. Enough jibber jabbing. Cool, all right. I got a puzzled Paul. And are these still stickers? No. Wait, maybe they are. Probably, who knows. And of course we got puzzle piece in the back. And I got a parallel already. Losing faith. I think, yeah, refactor. Okay, at least it told, sometimes they don't tell you what parallel you get. And I got a refactor parallel, which is one out of three packs. So not too bad. Yeah, I think I have a bunch of cars from this series because I recognize this puzzle piece. Trophy tray, do not recognize that card. Oh, I love it. I love these. And tuned on Tara. Turned on Tara. Oh, I love these. Oh, I, yeah, I, I think I have tons of these Series 4. I might even have a box of them. So yeah, you only get four cards in here. Okay. All right, pack two. They're garbage bail kids. I cannot complain too much. Distort and Morton. More of that puzzle. Here we got Walt Whitless. And Rocky, Ro Rocky Horror. Classic. Classic back, yeah. I must have mostly these cars because I recognize almost every single car in here. Bruce Moose. I like that they have indents and like stamping if you will but then they coat it in like uh plastic i think that's the chrome obviously and then i got a dazzling hygiene which what is that one that is a who knows what this is prism Maybe something or other. Prism reactor. Can't see. Cut it off. 
Prison Refactor. One out, no, there's no way. One out of 180 cards, packs, I mean, no way. If that's true, I open up Japanese, or I open up Chinese boxes of cards that have this speckly look to them. Almost every card has it. So it's can't be that expensive to do. But oh well. All right, pack number four. No, number three. I like tossed a pack over there. Sorry, this is pack three. We got a refactor of Igloo Classic. So many classic things here. Although, is that a refactor? No, that's not. Is it? No, it would say it, I guess, right? Who knows? Wait, what? No, 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 no. No, 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 don't do this to me. Don't give me the same card in the same pack and then just, it's a dumb parallel. Yeah, refactor. Come on. Ugh. No. Oh, hell yeah. Mecha Mike. There's a Godzilla one, too. I don't think I had this one as a kid. Ruby Cube. Is this new, maybe? Because this doesn't... This art style doesn't match the old-school creepy art style. See what I mean? So maybe this is new. What does this say here? So there's three atomic refactor refractor. So that must be what that card is. So is there anything that talks about like new cards? Original series four. I swear this is not. This looks new to me. In the comments below, let me know. This looks modern. Oh well. Stuff Stefan. Love it. And is this another atomic refactor? Um, yeah, they're not even on here. The atomic ref Oh no, yeah, one out of two. So that's what this is. Atomic refactor. Brett Vet. Love it. That's the puzzle. All right. Pack four. There's a. Uh... Sorry. Wait. I keep throwing packs over here. This is pack four. <laughs> My God. What is going on? Oh, it's because I'm looking... Th I'm looking through this and I'm putting them over here. Duh. All right. Rudy 2. Yeah. F Formaldehyde. I have all these old cards. That's great. Whispering Woody. Nothing like being a nostalgia nut and loving retro things and rebuying cars you already own for, you know, sextuple the price. Reese's Pieces. All right, penultimate pack, pack number five. Yeah, there's Ruby Cube. Locale, gotta love it. God, this art is so great. Who did this art? They're amazing. There's Brett Vett. And Hollywood. Gotta love it, checklist. Okay. Metal mat. Is that the Mecca one that I was confused about? Mecca Mike, that one's 6A. Okay, yeah, anniversary. Those are new, 6A, see these? One through six, those must be new. Cause this one probably has the Godzilla one. Somewhere, okay, moving along. You can pause it and read it yourself. All right, final pack, pack number six. Flaky Flay, Fakey Fay, 
gross dandruff, good old dog. And Alloy Adam. Yeah, this is new. Just this, I mean, look at the art. Look at this compared to that. This was done probably with ink and colored pencil. And this was done on a computer in like MS Paint. You be the judge. Another one of these. Warren Warren. And secondhand rose. And another atomic parallel of Hollywood. So yeah, that's cool. These were fun. I'm not sure why I got so many of this guy. Um, but uh, yeah, not too bad. I think, like I said, I think this was 20 bucks, which isn't too bad for shiny cards in America, at least. Um, I'd say if you like Garbage Pail Kids, these are a definite must get. Um, especially if you don't have any of the old, these old cards and I like getting the new cards. Um, so yeah, please uh, let me know what you think. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks everybody.